Well, there it is, gang. The cat's out of the bag. The number one heavy metal video of all time. Motley Crue smoking in the boys' room. And if my count doesn't fail me, that's their fifth video in the top 20. My God, it's a good year for them. Okay, now check this out. Last time the crew came through New York, I did an interview that I've been saving for a moment just like this. You'll never guess where I found them. I know they're in here. I just know they're in here. Come on. All right, this is a bust. Hey. I knew you'd be in here. Hey, Come hey, on, man. Put that in the line. Good man. Man, I've heard of chain smoking. This is ridiculous. <laughs> this is bad. All right. All right, I want to talk to you boys about a few things. First of all, why did you pick Smoking in the Boys Room as a song to do on this album? Um, well, we did it a long time ago, and it sounded awful. So we figured maybe we could get it to sound yeah, a little better. We get it right this time. <laughs> Total honesty on MTV. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's a great, it was a great choice. I mean, everybody, everybody can relate to that because so many people have smoked in the boys' room. Have you ever smoked in the boys' room? Oh yeah. I never did, you know. But I was looking. Me neither. At get out of here. <laughs> so uh, okay, only one person actually smoked in the boys' room. The last time you guys were on MTV, you said you were a street rock band that leaned more toward glam than heavy metal. What's your feelings about heavy metal and Motley Crue? So you know what we were, what we're doing right now, is what Motley Crue was doing before we made it, and then we changed, and now we're back to the beginning. To do what we've always done. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on, I'm lost as well. Uh, okay, what you're saying is, is that you were what you are now. Uh, but you changed for the last album, but now you're back to it. Yeah. Right. Well, I think the main problem with this whole heavy metal thing is everybody has a different definition of heavy metal. Do you have a definition of heavy metal? Well, I tell you, heavy metal is the way of life. It's no hobby. It's like looking at that audience and saying, hey, hey bud, bud, let's, let's party. party. <laughs> <laughs> yes, this is really happening. <laughs> you asked for it, you got it. That is the driving force behind MTV's Heavy Metal Mania. I want to thank all the fans who wrote in voting for the top 20 heavy metal videos of all time. And I want you to keep on writing because I got some great news. MTV is giving a Christmas present to all the headbangers in the United States of America. I am proud to announce that Heavy Metal Mania is going to be a regular monthly show the third Thursday of every month with me hosting throughout 1986. <sighs> so if you want to see your videos played, write letters to us. We'll answer the ones we can, but we listen to your suggestions. Now listen, this is your show and I am your host. I got to say goodbye for now. Merry Christmas. So long. Sayonara. Alvita Zane. See you in January. But don't you go Go anywhere because coming up right after this is my personal choice for next year's top 20 heavy metal videos motor hey yeah.